Hello traders, welcome back to Pips Traders YouTube channel. Thank you for your continuous support to my channel. Today in this video, we are going to be doing daily technical analysis in gold US dollar. Before starting our analysis, we we'll look at today's economic calendar, look at the events for today, then we will proceed with our analysis. Today is Wednesday, April 6th and when we look at the events for today, we have low impacting news on many currency pairs. But when we look at 7.30 p.m., we have medium impacting news on US dollar and Canadian dollar coming up. At 11.30 p.m. Indian Standard Time, we have high impacting news on US dollar. So plan your trade entry and exit based on this news calendar. Don't enter into the trade on wrong time. Let us start with our analysis. I'm in daily time frame of gold US dollar currency pairs. When we look at the overall price action in daily time frame, it is still in a very nice bullish trend. And it has gone up to the level of 2072, then the bearish trend reversal has happened. But at this point, when we notice the price action, it is not going down, but it is under a consolidation over this area. So when we mark this area, we can clearly understand that this area is acting as a very strong support. That's why the current market is struggling to break this support level. And when we look at the overall price action also, it is forming similar to one head and shoulder pattern. The left hand shoulder has been completed. Now it has completed the right hand shoulder also. Currently the price action is trying to break this neckline over here. Once the neckline is broken, we can expect a further fall on the bearish side in this currency pair. So we have two levels of support which is preventing the price action from falling down. One is the previous support level. Next one is the current head and shoulder neck level. Once these supports are broken, we can expect a fall. But till then we can expect a consolidation to continue in this currency pair. Let us mark the support and resistance levels in daily time frame. I've marked the support and resistance levels and this whole area marked in red color zone is going to be acting as a very strong support zone. This is between 1912 to 1874. And once the price action breaks this support zone, we can expect the next level of support to be around 1821 to 1753. I've also drawn a bullish channel pattern over here. When we look at the price action, the price was trading below this channel pattern resistance line. It has given a breakout from this channel pattern and now it is trying to break this channel pattern support line. But for now, current trend of the price action is on a bullish trend because the price action is trading above this bullish channel pattern. Only when it breaks this bullish channel pattern, we can expect a further fall or a bearish trend to start in this currency pair. Let us do the analysis in 4 hours time frame then to the hourly time frame. So I am in 4 hours time frame now. When we look at the price action in 4 hours time frame, we can clearly notice that this bullish channel pattern support line is acting as a very strong support. Momentarily it has broken this support line but again it has bounced back. Currently the price action is trading above this support line or the trend line. But on the bullish side also, you can notice that it doesn't have enough bullishness to go on a bullish side also. So it is narrowing down on the bullish side also and it is narrowing down on the bearish side also. It is sort of forming into a consolidation over here and a triangle pattern. Let me draw a trend line or the resistance line over here. It is very clear that the current price action is trading within a triangle pattern and it is in a consolidation. We can soon expect a breakout from this triangle pattern either on the bullish side or on the bearish side. Wait for the breakout for directional trades. And when we draw a trend line and check the current trend of the market, I am drawing a line from this point to the previous high and again one more trend line and again one more trend line. We can clearly notice that this trend line was acting as a resistance for the price action and every time the price action tested this resistance line, it has bounced back. 
and it has broken this next level of support again it went and tested the next level of support level and bounced back and took resistance on the previous resistance line and currently it is in a downtrend so overall when we look at the price action it is in a very nice downtrend the bearish trend is very clearly seen here but it has to clear this support level in order to continue with bearish trend reversal let us do the analysis in hourly time frame i am in hourly time frame now when we look at the price action in hourly time frame also it is in a very nice downtrend so wait for the price action to break this support line or a trend line then you can go trades on the bearish side trades currently the price action is in a consolidation within this bullish channel pattern support line and the resistance line from the 4 hours time frame let us mark the support and resistance levels so the values in blue color boxes are the support and resistance levels for hourly time frame let us do the analysis in 30 minutes time frame i am in 30 minutes time frame now when we look at the price action in 30 minutes time frame previously the price action was in a very nice bullish trend and you can notice that this line was acting as a support line for the past price action and currently it is acting as a resistance line and the price action has taken resistance at this resistance line and the bearish trend reversal had happened so when we look at the bottom side also this bullish channel pattern support line is acting as a support for the current price action and preventing the market from falling down on the bearish side once the price action breaks this support line we can expect it to trend down on the bearish side and take support on the hourly time frame trend line or the support line but this whole area is acting as a very strong support zone for the current price action so it has to break this trend line or the support line to continue with bearish trend reversal till the current price action is trading within a range or a triangle pattern but we can clearly notice that the bullishness is becoming weaker because it has not broken the previous high when it retraced last time let us mark the support and resistance levels for 30 minutes time frame so these are all the resistance and support levels for 30 minutes time frame currently the price action is consolidating and trying to break this bullish channel pattern support line if it manages to break this support line you can take trades on the bearish side or if the price action bounces back on the bullish side you can take trades on the bullish side and these are all the next level of targets let us do the analysis in 5 minutes time frame i am in 5 minutes time frame now when we look at the price action in 5 minutes time frame we can clearly notice that the current price action is under a consolidation i am drawing the trend line or the resistance line and it is forming into a symmetric triangle pattern which means there is no direction in the market soon we can expect a directional momentum in this price action it could be on the bullish side or on the bearish side please wait for the direction breakout to take a directional trade already we can see there is more momentum on the bearish side wait for it to break the previous low then you can go on a bearish side trade it will be the same for the bullish side also even if the price action breaks on the bullish side wait for it to break the previous high then you can go on a bullish side trades otherwise we can expect the price action to swing between this previous high and low let us mark the support and resistance levels for 5 minutes time frame so these are all the resistance and support levels for 5 minutes time frame currently the price action is consolidating within this symmetric triangle pattern that's all the analysis for today thank you for watching this video if you have found this video to be useful press that like button and share this video with your friends